ship. What makes you think that I'm gonna let the whitest man that I have ever seen interview for our firm? Uh, uh, because I have an appointment. Hmm. You can do this. Kid, what is wrong with you? You look like you're 11 years old. I was late to puberty. Okay. Thank you. Ruby Spectre. I was thinking about going for a swim. Are the pool facilities here nice? Of course, sir. It's the Chilton Hotel. Best in the city. Why is the pool closed? And, uh, do you have the time? Oh, yes. it's, uh, 10 o'clock. <clears throat> Thanks. I saw your gun. Oh, you think that's him? That's a description, but he didn't go in the room. It's 10 exactly. He's just walking by. Go after him. Stay on the radio. Rick Sorkin? Excuse me, Mr. Sorkin, you are five minutes late. Is there a reason why I should let you in? Look, I, look I'm just trying to ditch the cops, okay? I, I don't really care if you let me in or not. Mr. Spectre will be right with you. What? Can I get you anything? A coffee or a bottle of water? Hi, uh, Rick Sorkin. Harvey Specter, nice to meet you. Should you have a seat here? Whoa, what's this? Can I help you? No. Excuse me, Mr. Tate. Who are you? My name is Lewis Slitt. I work for Pearson Hardman. I have some information that I think will lead you to the conclusion that you're better served at Pearson with me as your lead counsel. I'm listening. How the hell did you know they were the police? I read this novel in elementary school. Um, cops are staking out a hotel. One of them dresses as a bellhop. The other is a man in a suit. And it was the exact same thing. You read a novel in elementary school? What? I like to read. And why'd you ask them what time it was? Uh, throw them off. I mean, what kind of drug dealer asks a cop what time it is when he's got a briefcase full of pot, right? We should hire you. Jesus, I'd give you the 25 grand as a signing bonus. I'll take it. Unfortunately, we only hire from Harvard. And you not only did not go to Harvard Law School, you haven't even gone to any law school. What if I told you that I consume knowledge like no one you've ever met and I've actually passed the bar? I'd say you're full of crap. That's a Barbie legal handbook right there, right? Open it up, read me something, anything. It's 
Civil liability associated with agency is based on several factors, including, including the deviation of the agent from his path, the reasonable inference of agency on behalf of the plaintiff, and the nature of the damages themselves. How did you know that? I learned it when I studied for the bar. Okay, Hotshot. Fire up this laptop. I'm gonna show you what a Harvard attorney can do. Pick a topic. Stock option backdating. Although backdating options is legal, violations arise related to disclosures under IRC section 409A. You forgot about Sarbanes-Oxley. The statute of limitations renders Sarbanes-Oxley moot post-2007. Well, not if you can find actions to cover up the violation as established in the Sixth Circuit in May 2008. It's impressive, but you're sitting at a computer. Playing hearts. Sorry, if you want to beat me, you're gonna have to do it at something else. How can you know all that? I told you, I like to read. And once I read something, I understand it. And once I understand it, I never forget it. Why take the bar? This dickhead bet me I couldn't pass it without going to law school. Okay, look, this is all pretty fascinating stuff, but I'm afraid I gotta get back to work. I'll make sure that Serpico isn't around waiting for you. this job so much why don't you just go to law school when I was in college it was my dream to be a lawyer I needed some money and Trevor convinced me to memorize this math test and sell it <laughs> turns out we sold it to the Dean's daughter I lost my scholarship I got kicked out of school I <sighs> I got knocked into a different life and I have been wishing for a way back ever since. Let me tell you something. This is an elementary school. This is hard work, long hours, high pressure. I need a grown goddamn man. You give me this, and I will work as hard as it takes to school those Harvard douches and become the best lawyer you have ever seen. I'm inclined to give you a shot, but what if I decide to go another way? I say that's fair. And sometimes I like to hang out with people who aren't that bright. You know, just to see how the other half lives. Move over. I'm emailing the firm. I just found our next associate. Hey, 